what's up YouTube uh, this is a little tutorial on uh, uh, it's just every tower we've had another tutorial like this just showing every tower just talking about every tower so let's see so um, right now I have a missile launcher a Goliath thrower an ice tower a um, blade shooter a spike pole and a um, wait sorry Monkey Apprentice. Now I have a Monkey Sorcerer. And on the Monkey Sorcerer, can I pop seven balloons at once? So, yeah. And now I have the Monkey Mage, which is a fireball pretty much. It's really cool. So, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna put on every tower possible. I'll try to actually. <laughs> Instead of saying. I will. But anyway, so what I'm doing is I'm gonna put a glue gunner. And glue gunners are really helpful. Um glue now I have a um glue yeah, I've still yeah, there's no change. But a, I have a thing called oh wait, what is it called? corrosive glue and um, it, it can dissolve through balloons every two seconds it slows down balloons which is my ra main reason why I want it so it has time to pop and um, the reason why I, why I put um, my glue thrower with my ice tower is because I want it to um I want it. I want it to. Um, it be as um the glee thrower can pop frozen balloons. That's what I was saying. So yeah. Anyway, so now I have a triple shot, the last upgrade to the um to the monkey to the dart monkey. And now I'm gonna get the last upgrade to the um cannon or bomb tower, and it's called the mob mauler, and the mob mauler increased fire attack rate and can um just and has ten times damage damage to um F well F what is it called? F or no B F B's and uh, mobs. So yeah. And that's really helpful at some points in the game to use. So yeah. So other towers, yeah, I need to put on this tower. So this tower is called the um, the um, the monkey ace. And what it does is um, it shoots starts. It flies. It shoots starts. And there, and the first upgrade is pineapple express, which drops a pineapple exploding pineapple. And yeah. So what I do. And now I have a rapid fire plane, which rapid fire just increases the attack rate and makes it quicker. So yeah, now I have that. And so I'm probably gonna go until I, I until um, I'm probably gonna launch a part two. Yeah. So what I'm gonna buy next, I'm gonna shoot for the uh, I'm gonna shoot for the Ring of Fire, and the Ring of Fire is really powerful, and um, it can pop anything you want it to. So yeah, and it, and I think it it has a quicker attack rate. I think every last upgrade has a quicker attack rate, but <clears throat> instead of some other things, um, I think the slowest attack rate is the um boomerang thrower. Sorry, I have to blow my nose one time. So yeah, and the boomerang thrower, it, um, it, it's last upgrade is a lightsaber thrower, which um can pop up to 70 balloons at once. So yeah. And now what I'm going to do next is the summon wind, which can blow blow balloons back to its, um, to the beginning. So yeah. So all these, uh, so now I'm gonna buy a monkey beacon, 
is really good. Oh, whoa, well, I need to put a... So, yeah, the monkey beacon is really helpful. So, what the monkey beacon does, well, it actually pretty much just increases the attack rate. So it makes a quicker attack rate. So yeah, now I have um, a, um, yeah, I have a sonar beacon, which is a um, thing where you can, oh yeah, now I have a lightsaber. A lightsaber thrower, you can read it, lightsaber slices through anything and everything. Up to 70 and up to 70 balloons at once. So, yeah. and it makes a quicker attack rate. So, yeah. So, the next thing I'm gonna go for is the, um, whoa, trash. Is the, the, um, yeah, the monkey buccaneer. And the monkey buccaneer is pretty good. I, I think it's. It's not really good, but I think it's pretty good. And there's this one upgrade called premium upgrade called Dreadnought. It makes the explode. Makes the not it. It the monkey buccaneer doesn't shoot uh, darts. It shoots um, flaming cannonballs, which I have on this. So, yeah. So the next thing I'm actually just gonna buy a glue splatter, which is very good. So it pretty much just. Um, affects everything so yeah and the next thing wait oh wait so yeah I have almost all the towers right now I'm going to save up for it is a um oh yeah there's this thing called Arctic Wind it's pretty expensive I mean I could get it by um, round 40 but it's still pretty expensive. I'm not gonna get it, even though I actually can afford it right now. <laughs> yeah, I might as well get it. So yeah, what the Ar Arctic Wind is is just domination, and it like slows balloons down after it pops so much. It's just amazing. So yeah, you know I have battleship on this. Yeah, now I'm gonna get Operation Dark Storm. Like shoots at least. 20, oh yeah, quick, much quicker attack rate, and it cheats, um, 20 darts, I believe, at once, I never really <laughs> counted, <laughs> but, anyway, what other towers, yeah, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get a super monkey, I'm just trying to do the simple towers, I, I think, I think using those super monkeys and getting to a high round is much better than, um, getting to a high round with super monkeys, I mean, I mean, oh yeah, and I have the triple mo or I have a motor battery, which is on um, triple the pain. <laughs> now it just shoots them. Um, it can shoot three, uh, um, bombs, missiles at once, or not at once, but it's no, it's in less than two seconds. So yeah, it shoots really fast, a quicker attack rate like all the towers. So yeah, now I'm gonna get the fourth upgrade which is the monkey storm. And now uh, that is really good. It doesn't cost that much. I mean, it's not like the Arctic wind. Oh yeah, and the next upgrade is called the Tempest Tornado. It's on this. And what it does, it just, it can affect so many balloons, 120 balloons at once. And then um, it has a, yeah, I have a monkey wizard now. And it can just affect so many balloons, which is really awesome. And it's what you want. It's what you want to go for. So, yeah. Yeah, these are all the simple towers, the fun towers to use. I don't really like using the um, uh, super monkeys or um, a, or what are they called? Uh, darling guns. I mean, they're pretty fun to use, but... Not as fun to use as um as these because these things 
I just it sometimes can screw up so much, but it's they're really fun to use because they're much cooler than um, super monkeys and stuff. Because like the upgrades, I think are cooler. Like plasma vision is not that cool. I think the the only cool upgrade on the sun god is the sun god. I mean, the super monkey is the sun god. It's, it's just it's just not original. Uh, you kind of do expect from a super monkey to shoot plasma vision or a laser. Like not some god though. That's what makes it so cool. So yeah. So now I'm just gonna pretty much just Oh yeah. Destroying mobs is pretty hard. Oh yeah, and you see that effect to the balloons. Oh yeah, and what I really like about the Arctic wind is it actually can pop a lot of balloons. I'll just put a laser cannon just just for like all the towers, so I can say I put all the towers on. So the increased barrel spin, I'll just tell you a little about it. Just it just increases the attack rate. Does it just increases the attack rate? So yeah. So I'm just gonna sit here and watch until I get my laser cannon. Laser cannon. So I'm pretty much using all the towers right now, except for the sun god and the banana farm. Which I actually might buy a banana farm. Oh yeah, and you'll notice that I can get more lives because I have healthy bananas. They're really cool. And it's like something you want to go for. So now I have a banana republic. I'm just gonna pretty much just oh yeah, and Banana Republics are a great investment. Like if, if you buy if you buy Banana Republics before round forty, they can make a huge effect in the game. Or if you even buy Banana Republics at round um thirty, that can even make a bigger effect because it gives you a lot of money and it gives you money when you need it. I just like Banana Farms because sometimes I feel like that. My my money is always short. I'm always short on money for something, and usually I am. So yeah. Oh, so I just pretty much just beat the on and on easy, which I've done a lot of times. So uh, thanks for watching. I will post more videos, of course, as usual. Thank you.